oh hey guys this is gonna be a totally different type of video um i wanted to do something that was Let's just let the raggedy ass motorcycle go by. So like I was saying, this is a totally different video. Um, and yes, I'm in the comfort of my room. I love my room. My room is my quiet place. It's my happy place as well. And I'm really good at giving um, advice. I'm really good at giving advice because I'm going to give good advice. I'm not going to give you something that's going to hurt you or whatever plus i'm a good i'm a bomb ass friend like period i'm a bomb ass friend like i know that i am like the best i'm i'm a very good friend so so friends come join me and i'm gonna tell you how you know that he is into you <laughs> Ew. okay so boom number one he definitely has to be texting and calling you frequently. Like, you need good morning texts. You need, hey, bae, what's going on? How you feeling? How was your day? Um, How did work go? How was your meeting? Was everything successful? Like, that's the type of stuff that you need. If you have a guy that he's not really giving it, sis, just. I miss your, miss your smile, I miss your face. <laughs> All that extra good stuff. Like, that's the good stuff. That's the stuff we want. That's the stuff we yearn for. So, text messages and calls. That's number one. Okay, now, because remember, like, how I asked about him asking, like, how was your job and everything. So, number two, I would say, is maybe him popping up with some flowers. <laughs> I mean... A girl loves a little flower, you know. We are like flowers, you know. We grow and you get plucked from time to time because we smell fresh and a man wants to hmm, smell us and hold and look at us and see the beautiness within us. So, flowers. Him popping to the job flowers. That's, that's how you know he's into you, girl. Let me get close because it's kind of important. Like, I need him to ask, am, am I hungry? I'd I be hungry, okay? Like, mm -hmm. I'm, I really be hungry. Like, I, I need you to ask, ma'am, have you ate today? No, I haven't ate. Let's go get some chicken wings. Because <laughs> that's my favorite is chicken wings. I don't know what your favorite is. But my favorite is chicken wings. So my camera did something really weird. I don't know what it did. Um, I don't I don't know what it did. But like we were saying, we're hungry. Make sure he's asking you if you're hungry and you want chicken wing and pho and big macaroni and cheese and lobster and cake with asparagus and wine. Hmm. And that leads to Number four, making sure he's taking you out for dates and lunch. Dates and lunch are a great way to get in tune with each other. So if he enjoys stuff like that, that means that he's definitely into you. He wants to sit down and conversate and really get to know the girl that's sitting in front of him. It's so bad that these days these guys just want to Netflix and chill and a little boom boom with a boom boom. <laughs> And at the end of the day, don't nobody got no time for that. Take me out. I want to go outside. I want to smell the air and the fresh air. I want to go outside. <sighs> the leaves. I want to feel the cold ass air while we hold each other's hand and go somewhere. Don't nobody want to sit in the house. Okay. Make sure you take you on dates, sis. But if he's taking you on dates, is he winning? So, um, another thing, which is number five. If a guy is really into you and like me i'm single mom so you know i have my two lovely children um but this is very important 
this motorcycle. Go! Okay, we're back. Okay, he's going out. If you have children and he's interested, he doesn't know that you're a package deal. So if while he's interested in you and he knows that these kids come with you he's definitely a keeper if he's a man that's asking about your children um you know including them in things and going places together and asking yo ma you know um winter time's coming up the kids need something need some hats gloves coat scarf boot uggs do they need something sis I need you to do one or two things. Secure the man. If he's asking you about them kids, girl, just erase all the other men on your phone because <laughs> ding, 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 you're winning, okay? Yes, <laughs> yes you are. Because if he ain't asking nothing, again, he gotta go. Okay. This is number six, and then I do have number seven. But number six, I feel like it's super important when a guy is into you, if he has told you that he's dating and like, okay, I'm dating other girls. Like, this is this is what's going on. You know, I was talking to Keisha or whatever. We were kind of okay, but things just weren't really what I thought it was until I met you. So I'm thinking about cutting her off. Oh, you want to cut her off, do we? Okay. Oh. Oh. You're cutting females off from me. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like, there's not a lot of men that are doing that these days. They want a side chick and the back chick and the other chick, the one from around the corner, and boo boo and she she from time to time. So, if he's cutting women off, honey, like, yeah like that's that's what we need like and don't settle for anything else like, and, and that's period like any man that's doing that he's a keeper there's not too many men doing that these days do you hear me do you hear me like do you hear me okay stay back a little bit you too close and baby, last but definitely not least, this is how you're going to know that you have a man, honey. Let me get comfortable for this one. If that man knows that you have goals and dreams and ambition and he says, baby, I just want you to take your stuff to the next level. I'm willing to invest. I want you to do just this. You grab your purse, right? And your keys. And you just like this. Come on, baby, let's go. Come on. We're going right downtown to go get married. Just, just, just marry the man. Okay? Just marry the man. So if he's doing number steps one through, through seven. Ooh, my nails. Excuse it. <laughs> One through seven. Then you've got a keeper, sis. So I hope you've learned something today. And we'll have more subjects coming up very soon. I think my next subject is going to be how you keep the toti fresh. I think that's another important one that can kind of add on to this because that's how what helps you secure the nigga. Okay, you you guys have a great day. Be blessed. Mwah.